Okay, everybody, it is just before 7 o'clock uh, Eastern Standard Time on September the 4th. And you can see I've got some uh, yellow tri or rectangles here on my 240-minute bar. And really, that's to illustrate that we've got a, a sandwich going on here uh, between the weekly uh, resistance up here at the top and the weekly support down here at the bottom. Uh, maybe if the market breaks out into this area, you'll get a, a fast move back down to these lows. And you might get the market moving up if it breaks through these highs. But if we scroll back here just a little bit, you can see that just above this area here, you've got a lot of resistance right there. Uh, and then you've got uh, this, this is really a head and shoulders pattern over here. Uh, I know I haven't really covered this, and I do know that in the kit I mentioned the head and shoulders, but I didn't really talk about it a lot. Uh, it's a very, very rare pattern. That's why, in fact, if you look back uh, on this 240-minute bar, you might find one or two of these things. Uh, but suffice it to say that uh, just very quickly here, for those of you who don't know, uh, a head and shoulders pattern looks like uh, a couple of shoulders here, and then you know, you've got the head going on right there. And the neckline, or the line in between the two shoulders, is where traders sometimes look to take positions, in this case going to the downside. So that's why it gets the term head and shoulders, because it looks like a head with two shoulders. Um, so if the market does break above this high here, there's a lot of resistance in this area. I don't think there's going to be much in the way of a trending type of move. I think, uh, again, you're looking at uh, some... I wouldn't say dangerous trading, but trading that you've really got to be aware of. Uh, you, you do have some long opportunities above 2.02, whoops, 2.0233. That's above this high right here. And then uh, also I think some short opportunities below this level here, which is roughly speaking, uh, here we go, short below 1.9952. Uh, you know, I just I don't see a whole lot going on there. There's nothing really in the way of patterns going on here. Um, you know, this triangle was starting to form right here, but you can see it just petered out. Uh, the upside here started to form uh, a nice triangle pattern uh, or bullish or sorry, uh, yeah, bullish wedge. But that just puked out here coming into the New York session. So not a whole lot going on. Just you remember, uh, you know. Patience is a virtue. <laughs> keep your powder dry. We'll uh, keep watching this thing to see what sets up.